Welcome to Showcase Richmond, I'm Matt DiNardo. In Virginia, there are hundreds of children through no fault of their own that are in need of and looking for a loving, permanent home. To help spread awareness on education on how these children can be adopted and fostered is Connecting Hearts, the Deborah J. Johnston Foundation. The Connecting Hearts is the focus of today's Good News segment made possible by Care Advantage, changing our community one charity at a time. Since the 1930s, comic books have become a staple of American pop culture. And it's from the stories inside that we read about superheroes like Superman. But before Superman could save the world, two people had to save him through the power of adoption. Hundreds of kids in Virginia alone are still looking for their forever home. Hundreds of kids who will never celebrate a birthday or Christmas with a family of their own. Hundreds of kids who like Superman need you to teach them how to fly. Hundreds of kids. Together, we can make a difference. Together, we can give these kids everything they deserve and dream of. Will you be their superhero? And with us now is Erica Facetti, the Executive Director for Connecting Hearts, the Deborah J. Johnson Foundation. Thanks so much again for joining us in Showcase Richmond. Thanks for having me. Erica, let's remind our Showcase viewers, what is the purpose of Connecting Hearts? So Connecting Hearts is a statewide organization. We are focused on adoption and foster care, really collaborating with all of our partners, both Department of Social Services and the private agencies throughout the state to spread awareness about what's happening with our state in regards to the kids who need permanent loving homes. How many children right now need that permanent loving home in our state? We are over 850 children of all different ages that are looking for permanent loving homes. Now when we talk about adopting, if somebody wants to begin adopting, what's the first step in that process? What they would want to do is contact their local Department of Social Services. If you visit our website there's resources, phone numbers, email addresses of all of those departments and they can always call us for information as well. All right, so we talk about adoptions here. We have a full screen graphic. It's kind of a flyer to talk about this. And it's, uh, this is a big deal. You said over 800 children in Virginia, and that's a small percentage of nationwide, of course, which is a much bigger problem. Absolutely, this is a huge problem across the country. So we're really trying to bring awareness in the state of Virginia, but also let people know that we need some sustainable long-term goals that we can have for our country to really solve this problem. And there's the national number, of course, is 1-800-DO-ADOPT. We have a local number we'll be talking about too. DSSVirginia.gov uh, will help us there. But some of the events that the Deborah J. Johnson Foundation Connecting Hearts is part of, you have some events coming up to really kind of get awareness and to raise funds to help these children along. And families. Absolutely. So we're really excited about our first annual golf tournament on October 12th at the Hermitage Country Club. It will be a different day of golf because we will have foster care youth present. They'll be volunteering as well as playing with some of the teams to really give them that exposure to the game of golf and let people know about the awareness straight from these kids' mouths. And we're still looking for teams to sign up. There's lots of availability for uh, teams to come and play, join, and of course help this great event. Absolutely. We would love to have as many teams and as much support as possible. Now, there's a conference also coming up. This is the first annual Virginia Adoption and Foster Care Conference. Tell us a little bit about this. This is on November 5th. Yes, this is the first type of conference that we've had in the state of Virginia where we're inviting all professionals in foster care as well as adoption to bring them together to really do some education, some collaboration, come together for free, and really think about how we can make some sustainable changes in Virginia. How can our viewers help out the Connecting Hearts? They can visit our website to see upcoming events that they can volunteer at. There's also um, a way to make donations online. We are always happy to have people mail checks to the Deborah J. Johnson Foundation as well. All right, you can see that they get the website connectingheartsva.org. You can call them directly 804 308 5946. You can email Erica as well. We'd like to thank Care Advantage for their help with this segment and bring you awareness about connecting hearts.